Now, as you've been watching this documentary, you have now been seeing different things that uh, about me. So I kind of expose myself. Uh, first thing I wanted to let people know is I had what's called an out-of-body experience. Or as people call it, a spiritual experience, whatever you want to call it. I had a chance to leave my body one Friday night. I just don't remember the month. It was the summertime. So I don't remember the month, day, or the year. But... Once when I did, when my spirit did leave my body, all of a sudden I was looking at myself personally and all I could think about was how all the hurt, pain, it's just like this person that was in this in my bed seemed to have all this pain that was in it. Then this woman took me. All of a sudden she held my hand as tight as can be. Next thing we know, they had a hole in the floor. We dropped all the way down. She had, I had a chance to see everything, what people call hell, underworld, Hades, whatever you want to call it. I had a chance to see that. There's more than one level of uh, hell, as I call it. Uh, there are different levels. Uh, I don't do, I'll don't. i probably get into detail in my autobiography, but bottom line is once I had a chance to see all that, and once I seen what was down there, next thing I know we went up, and all I seen was what people call heaven, uh, uh, peaceful afterlife or whatever you want to call it uh, bright I uh, had a chance to see different people many races up there had a chance to see what they you call God Jesus whoever you want to call this spirit had a chance to see him and kind of had a chance to question him which I know a lot of people don't question you're not really supposed to question God Jesus whoever but I did have a chance to uh, question him for a few questions which I'm sure in my autobiography I'm going to go into more detail about all of this. This is just kind of a brief summary of what I wanted to uh, add to into the documentary. Not only that, I kind of wanted to add what my name means. It has four different meanings. Uh, one of them it means uh, God will establish. It also means God will exalt. Uh, God will restore and God is high. Also, throughout this documentary, I also wanted to talk about kind of uh, personal hell, I went. I say personal hell, but it was, as a teenager and, and throughout my autobiography, I'll go into more detail about it. But I did kind of have 
a kind of an abusive ex-stepfather kind of a uh, I guess beat me every now and then I mean have you ever had anybody chase you with a knife or gun <laughs> uh, I guess mainly it kind of made me a little stronger I'm not person I I guess I would be but I'm the person I am today also not only do I want to add that but I've been hearing a lot of rumors, especially with me, of my sexual orientation, which I want to kind of clarify, and I want to go into de kind of detail. But in my autobiography, I'll detail it, bottom line, brief detail. Uh, I believe in people, whoever you are, no matter race, religion, color, whoever, sexual orientation. I have a lot of artists that are different sexual orientations, different racial backgrounds, mostly are rappers. And as you will see this documentary, you'll see some of my uh, pictures of some of my artists in here. Uh, bottom line is, bisexuality is not homosexuality. Bottom line, people people get that confused. In if you're thinking about somebody being bisexual, you're thinking about, oh, and I know a lot of girls think about, no, no, he queer, no, bottom line, no. It is, you might have feelings for both men and women, but at some point in life, you probably will find yourself spending some time with the whoever you want. The person you love in life it doesn't matter who it is because we don't judge and also throughout my lifetime and throughout what I've done in years I've learned man anybody can accomplish any dream even you okay this is a poem that I had written that ultimately uh, came from the song Be One With God, or should I say the poem Be One With God, it's called Who Am I? And it starts off with, Who am I? A prince, a king, a man, a son, a boy, a man made by God. Uh, who am I? The lover, the warrior, the strength that holds a family together. Who am I? A man, I am, the creation that the Creator has made. 